this light language transmission is to bring together a few um, energetic upgrades and light codes that have come in over the last few days. Um, it's um, going to include some codes from the painting um, that I've just finished there, which um, contains a whole lot of light codes around um, the strawberry full moon eclipse we just had, um, all the healings and energetic shifts um, that came in at that time were around unity, non-judgment, um, releasing expectation of others, releasing others expectation on us, clearing anger um, around where our expectations have not been met by others. Um, in the community there's been um, a lot of upheaval around racism and police brutality um, that came into it. The, um, the hands in the image um, are prayer hands and the example I used as the template to paint them was a black hand and a white hand but I have um, painted it as multicoloured to include all races, colours, spectrums, um, attitudes um, and in the prayer hand meaning coming together. Um, the divine in me greets the divine in you, seeing each other's beauty. Um, and uh, celebrating differences, seeing the beauty in the differences and seeing the similarities in each other. Um, all the healings I did over that period um, came into what we call a still point in um, craniosacral therapy, which is um, pulling everything into the void um, to the basically the cosmic room um uh, the the um into the depths of the god self really where it's all um received and reorganized in this very still space and then expands out again so you can see it like a seed then growing all the shifts and changes based on the information that's been received um, by the God that we're all connected to and then reorganised to address everything. Um, and as it was regrowing, it was regrowing a new reality in terms of the Garden of Eden, a unity consciousness, um, a, a world... Um, run on the laws of beauty and um, reciprocity and unconditional love and acceptance and harmony. Um, so all these seeds right through all of humanity, all of the planet, all of the cosmos, all reorganising and growing. Um, and... The results that I found from that was this pushing out through the personality selves um, of all the things that were not that. So a lot of anger coming up, a lot of um, sadness, frustration, um, fatiguing, um, uh, density, all shifting out. And after it moved out, what was emerging from underneath was this immense love, unconditional love, spiritual love. So everything you touch is touched with love. Every movement you make is graceful because it's moved by love. Um, every um, thing you encounter externally, you're seeing through the eyes of love. So you're accepting pain or disappointment or whatever anyone else is going through because you're seeing it through the eyes of love um, 
and I've seen this reflected back to me in my environment as well um, seeing love huts everywhere in unexpected places I've always seen these but it's stepped up a notch um, as I've been really aware of this energy coming through um, so what I wanted to do really is share this energy um, the painting the sky um, is supposed to reflect the the blending of all the different flavors of humanity um, as well as really being able to see the distinct brightly colored differences um, and how that is uh, um, above in the um, higher dimensions and then reflected down um, from the template into physical reality and you can see the waves on the shore there um, holding the reflections of the divine template whilst also um, the waves themselves represent the waves of the energy coming through as it comes through in waves and washes over you and then once you've cleared one level um, another wave will come through and clear the next level. Um, at the hands, though they're in the Namaste prayer position, which is connecting um, conscious awareness to the divine um, and also as a greeting, the divine in me greets divine in you. Also, you can see they're slightly open, so you can see the reflected strawberry full moon through um, through the hands they're also representing the womb um, the cosmic womb um, and the rebirthing um, and the moon um, with its reflection represents the infinite again that passage of the divine into physical reality so I would like to do just a little bit of um, healing or light language um, to emphasize the um, the codes the light codes and help you to receive them Isa arama ana ama ina ana ina ana ina ana ina ana a ina a a ina a a ina a Isa ana ama ana ina ama ana 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 a Isa ana ama ana 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 a Isa ama ana 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 a Isa ana ina ana ina ana ina ana e Isa ana ina 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 e Isa ana ina 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 e Isa ana antara anka ana ina a Isa ana antara ana ina ana a Isa ana ina ana ina ana a Isa ana ina a a a Isa ana ina ana ina ana a Isa ana a ana a a Also want to point out that um the other theme coming up has been reflection so it's not just a reflection of the sky on the earth representing the divine and manifesting into reality it's also um and and within that there's the um you can see the um unity of all the colors in the sky as they form their own shape um it's supposed to represent movement i hope you can see the movement in that and it's also supposed to represent multi-dimensional um movement um, and how one dimension flows into the other but also um within each of us how everything we encounter every body we encounter every um thing we see or read um is a mirror reflection back to us and it's for, for us to ponder on and um, notice the similarities, notice what's being reflected back, um, question what that means for us, do we hold that in ourselves? is there some part of us that does that um, and work with it, move it through, accept it, love it and shift it or elevate it. Um, so 
those coats are also held in this painting and um, I'll put a picture there of my cup of tea this morning um, which once I consumed uh, my chaga mushroom tea there was a love heart in the bottom this this happens a lot to me and um, I feel that's the universe reflecting back to me um, the love um, and especially as that's what's really profoundly in this painting yeah that's all so I hope you enjoy that I hope you receive the codes um, both in the painting and in the transmission and um, listen to it as many times as you need to and do drink water and integrate Blessings.